Good evening, everyone. This is Miko, Yataka Performance. So for this evening, I've got this Red Max EB7001 blower motor. Um, the story behind it is that I ended up getting this one in here because they were saying that the motor was seized up. Well, I managed to get it unseized. I managed to fire it up and start it. However, by the time the two minute mark started coming in, it started rattling like crazy. So I was hearing piston slap, um, the internals just started getting louder and louder. And then uh, after that, I shut it out. Uh, I turned the uh, motor off and I'm gonna show you why. Okay, so I'm gonna just uh, bring it around over here real quick. This is the carburetor and I'm not quite sure if you can really see it, but that piston is not supposed to look like that. You are not supposed to be able to see that rod right through the piston. So that's going to be what I'm doing for this evening. I'm going to be tearing this motor down. I've already ordered the piston and rings for him. It's actually right over here. So I got a new one. Nice and shiny. And we'll be doing this installation here and then on the very next take, hopefully it's going to be nice, smooth sailing from there. Alright, so time to get to work on this little Red Max blower. Okay, so uh, 25 minutes later, I got the motor taken apart. Now I'm going to flip this around like so. Alright, this right here is not looking too good. A lot of metal shards. I mean, on this one right here, I already started kind of wiping it down a little bit, but you see all those little metal shavings right there. And then, boom, piston. That's no good. So, well, hopefully, you know, this uh, little motor is going to be salvageable. We'll find out here shortly. Again, a piston is not supposed to look like that. It's supposed to look like this. All fully intact. All right, so. I'm going to get going. Good morning everyone, this is Miko, Yadiko Performance. Uh, the other day we were working on the Red Max EB7001 leaf blower. And so this is the final product right here. Now you may not really be able to see much because of the uh, plastic coating and everything else, the covers. but. The exhaust was cleaned up, carburetor was cleaned up, the piston was already replaced. Um, I ended up replacing that, so I just made sure that you know everything was all nice and clean. And now we're going to test it to see if it's going to be a one-time pull start crank. All right. Now, wish me luck. Now again, mind you, this is a Red Max EB seven thousand and one.
Well, there you have it. We have a good fully functioning blower motor. And uh, it was a cold start, that's why I ended up taking in about two more cranks. But other than that, it sounds nice, perfect, it idles great. Now, uh, let's see here. I do want to say one thing. The first time I ordered this piston, I made a mistake. So uh, that's why it actually ended up taking a little bit longer for me to reorder another one. But um, there was actually a difference on piston size if the trigger was on the left handle right here or if the trigger was on the blower handle itself right around here and so again this video should have been posted up a long time ago it's just I ended up making that mistake and ordering the wrong piston size because I didn't know that what the differences were where the uh, trigger location was but uh, but at least now the job is done so the customer is already on its way here to pick it up and uh, again on to the next project. This is Miko, Yadiko Performance. See you guys later.